Yo guys, so I just arrived to um, AK Auto Express. I have the window over here. As well as I have um, Ashton over here as well. So Ashton will be the one that will be obviously doing the spray work. He owns um, AK Auto Express. And then what we're doing right now is we're just going to test with the bumper. I have the bumper over here. So we're just going to test with the bumper. Um, then to my understanding, Ashton and the window already uh, got the color code. So we can basically um, have the bumper sprayed and then by next week sometime the bumper can be fitted so like I mentioned also we're just going to test fit so everything lines up properly and then basically just needs color and then um, the bumper or the car will be all ready um, what I'm also going to do later in this video is maybe just sit down with the winner and just have a discussion a little bit get to know him a little bit and then um, maybe even do a before video of what the car looks like right now and then obviously when the car is all done we can do a reveal video and some cinematics um, on that as well So this is what the car looks like with the bumper on. Um, I think there needs to be um, some cutting away on the, um, the bumper. What do you call that now again? What's it called? The stiffener. So that it can just sit a little bit smooth on the side. But other than that, footman is pretty good. As you guys can see, it's all aired out. Um, cool thing also is that his lip that he has on his current bumper will also go onto the WRC bumper as well so it will just finish it off nice um, then yeah we pretty much have the fitment everything we know what we need to do and then we have the color and then we're just going to spray and then have it fitted but this is how the car sits right now let me just give you guys a full walk around on the car as well this is what the car looks like This is the rear. So CK is actually from Almersbury. Uh, the owner is from Almersbury. Silver mirrors. We were thinking of maybe making this silver. And I think it's going to stand too much up. guys so i have the stickers on the car as well this them over there and wrong spec and then also something i just failed to mention everything that you basically see on this car i can supply you as well um, i can also courier to you anywhere in the world or anywhere in the country so everything that you literally see on this car i can supply you with um, so say for example you need a lip like this i think this is a kersher lip and then that's a three-piece um, side skirt over there um, what I can also do is get you the Utinga rear wing as you guys have seen I have installed one on a Golf 7R this one might be removed because we are going maybe with a WRC um, wing as well as a WRC side skirts as well so the car will basically be converted to WRC uh, polo so yeah guys that's just some information I thought I'd share with you uh, this diffuser I can also get for you as well Okay, then quiet, 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 quiet. Basically, we're going to have two covers of paper. Uh, to close it. Yeah. And put two eight inch. Yes. And can it make this in map like this? Yeah. So you're basically going to cover the compressor and stuff and so on with, no? Yeah. So that will be kind of hidden. Maybe a little sign over here. A uh, sticker to here will also look fine.
Ryan van Eden did a shoot at. I have both cars over here. Also, I have the owner in the background over there. He's a little bit shy, uh, so we'll maybe just do um, a little bit of an interview once um, the car is done. But yeah, this is both cars over here. Um, this is the car that my friend did Ashton. Uh, like I mentioned, this is the Tornado Red. Um, yeah, it looks pretty good. Okay guys, so like I was saying, this is... years later hey, my dudes so it's actually been a few um, weeks I would say since we last made the video with um, the giveaway bumper winner like I mentioned previously um, he unfortunately lives far so it isn't easy for us to just link up whenever we can the bumper was done um, however we just had to wait for a good date where we could all meet up together so we are going to link up with the winner, fit the bumper for him and then maybe just go for a little bit of a drive and do some cinematics. What I might just do is um, I might just take the EG with as well. So the last time we had the Type R and I will have the EG with the, the Polo as well as the Polo's new WRC front bumper. So yeah, without further ado, let's bust the move. Okay guys, so the EG actually didn't want to start. I had to jump start it um, because I don't actually drive this car as much so yeah but anyway car started right now the car is actually very dirty however I'm gonna take it with anyway maybe when I do cinematics it will just be maybe further away and maybe not some close-ups but yeah I just have to get a few parts for, for someone and then they're going to collect it at the warehouse or at the workshop um, where I'm going to link up with the winner and then do the bumper guys so um, Ashton actually really finished up the whole car it's actually even driving the we got the um, clip that needed to be in the bumper but anyway Ashton already finished the car uh, what we are basically going to do right now is just film the car and show you guys what the car looks like um, we do plan on linking up in future because the car is going to be at slam by the lake and it's also going to have the Wong spec stickers on etc um, so that is what we are going to do in future There is a few things that still need to be done. I think is uh, Door something still needs to be sprayed 
so yeah that e this isn't the last that you are going to see the car but yeah i'm going to give you guys a full walk around on the car and then maybe do a cinematic of the eg as well as um, the wong speak polo or i would say or the winner's car so yeah let's get started with the cinematics <laughs> Okay guys, so I have the owner here with me, um, like I mentioned the bumper is all ready, uh, Ashton did uh, an amazing job and like I also mentioned we do plan on meeting up in future and then maybe just doing a few odds and ends. So I have the, um, the owner over here, so um, his name is Gershwin, just gonna ask him a few questions. So Gershwin, are you happy with the outcome of how the polo looks? Yes, um, I'm very happy. I'm very yeah. happy so i recall uh, you were actually one of the first guys to actually enter the thing now i think i mentioned it to you before it actually went live and you already like subscribed to the channel etc so you was actually one of the first guys so i ironically actually won it so another thing that um, we will be seeing him is at um what is the stance by the lake right slam at the lake slam at the lake so you guys can expect him over there um he's very happy with the outcome as well as myself so i'm just going to give you guys a quick walk around on the car this is what the front bumper looks like came out amazing we might just put, push the lip a little bit further back but yeah i gave you guys a full walk around on the car before uh, like i also mentioned um, all the parts is on the car i can supply you guys with as well if you guys are interested and as you guys know his car is on e we also have the eg over here so yeah guys this is basically going to be the end or the end of this section of the video I might just link up with a friend of mine Basil and then we might just um, uh, work on his car as well I might e end up uh, maybe putting it in this video as well or I might not but yeah hope you guys enjoy the content please do press the like button subscribe to the channel and comment in uh, the comment section what do you guys think of uh, Gershwin's new bumper um, so yeah I hope you guys enjoy the content and I hope to see you guys next time. Peace.